Hi everyone! Today I have four nail polishes to share with you from the brand Barry M and these are the Under the Sea collection polishes. Barry M is a UK based brand that's available in Boots and Superdrug but they've also expanded internationally now as well. So the Under the Sea collection, they come with its beautiful lid that obviously represents Under the Sea and they are all sh very shimmery duochrome polishes. So I'm going to start off with Electric Eel and this is a very blue based um, polish with lots and lots of golden shimmer in it. As you can see it is a very sheer polish um, I think you can probably layer it over colours as well. Um, you can layer it over white or for a very intense look you can lay it over black as well. But I've decided to just go um, over a plain nail and see how it builds up. As you can see with the second coat, the colour definitely builds up, but it is still um, very much on the sheer side. It dries a little bit on the matte side, so I would recommend adding a top coat to get it nice and glossy. I'm going to leave it at three coats. You can still see some imperfections through my nail and a slight nail line, um, but because it is so shimmery, as I adjust my nails, it looks like it's almost opaque. So that is three coats of Electric Eel. Next up I have Pacific Flame and this is um, kind of a, a pink based red polish as the base and it has this very strong green shimmer. This is a little bit more opaque than the previous polish but definitely still on the sheer side. It builds up really nicely in two coats and it is nearly opaque in just two coats. Again, I would recommend going for a top coat just to get it nice and glossy. I'm going for a third coat just to get it even more um, opaque, but you can probably get away with just doing the two coats as it is a very shimmery polish and you kind of lose the nail line as you move your nail around. Next up I have Seahorse and this is a very dark, almost brownish base with a very strong purple shimmer. This is similar to the first polish where it is very very sheer on the first coat but it does build up quite nicely. I really like the brush on these polishes, they're a slightly wider brush which I find really easy to use, it kind of spreads up on my nail really nicely. Again, it dries a little bit on the matte side, so I would recommend going for a top coat. Again, you can layer these over a white polish or a black polish. Over a black polish, you'll really see that shimmer stand out even more. I am going to go for a third coat, just to get it as opaque as possible. But like I said with the previous polishes as well, when you move your nail around, because the shimmer is so strong in them, you lose any imperfections and you don't see your nail line whatsoever. And the last polish that I have to show you is called Moonfish and this is a very very light pale blue base with that same kind of pink shimmer in it. Again it is a very very sheer polish especially as this is the lightest polish in the collection. The colour slightly brightens up on that second coat but it is still very sheer. What I like about this colour in particular is that it gives you this really clean pearly look on the nails. So it's great for any like fancy events or even for a wedding or something like that. And it'll be really nice in the winter time as well when it's going to be cold and snowy outside. I think it's a really nice clean crisp look. So I'm going to leave it again at three coats, it is nearly opaque on the three coats but like I said when you move your nail around you don't even notice your nail line. So those are the four Barry M nail polishes from the Under the Sea collection. My favourite is definitely Electric Eel, I think it's the brightest one from the collection and it's the one I'm most likely to use but again that last polish as well, I think it's a really nice and clean crisp look on the nails just in case of like a palette cleanser. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.